Actually, it's just the back of his uh, back, uh, more like tricep. But uh, he should be fine, actually. Uh, we're not too concerned about it, to be honest. Same thing with Malky. Yeah, Malky just, uh, for precautionary reasons, going in there, he, he jammed his left wrist, I think it was, uh, into the, yeah, I think it was left wrist. Don't quote me on that, but he jammed it into that, that uh, fencing that's over there. Uh, they took an x-ray, it was negative. Everything's okay, so maybe a mild, very mild sprain, um, but he should be fine. Only one runner to second base in these two games. Is yeah. it the combination of good pitching and guys maybe pressing a little bit? Uh, you're right. I think it's a combination of both. Uh, you know, we, we talked about it a little bit. You have uh, uh, some pitchers that have been uh, through uh, the most extensive of, of performances over the last couple of years in terms of, you know, uh, how good they are. Uh, I think they've uh, come into this series really focused on doing their job. Uh, and for us, it's one of those, uh, for me, as, as we're talking to you, it's about our learning curve now, understanding that these guys are really, you know, executing and doing what they want to do. And we want to make sure that we give ourselves a chance by uh, staying and trusting with the approaches that we take into the, uh, the at-bats. Try not to focus too much on the results and stay focused on the approaches. You know, and uh, we know that the results will take care of themselves. But I think, you know, the guys are, are wanting to get the big hit or wanting to drive a ball out of the ballpark as opposed to just staying very, very simple. And so uh, I think it's a great learning lesson for all of us as a, as a club. Uh, every single player from uh, one through nine through for the guys that are on the bench uh, to see how they're, they're going after us. And uh, we just have to make some adjustments. Really exciting. I think everybody was pumped up. Uh, you know, he's been grinding it out. Um, you know, when when we hit for Malky, I know I, I was talking to Joey. I said, you know, he's, he's not going to have any time to think about it. So he's going to get into the box and, you know, keep it probably as simple as possible. I don't think he even had enough time to put his, his guard on his shin. And uh, just got a pitch out over the, the middle of the plate and, and stayed within himself and just drove it up the middle, which was nice to see. Obviously very excited for him. Uh, felt for you. Yeah. Nearly get, got you five innings, probably gets it without that error. Seems yeah. like that's what you want out of him. Yeah, absolutely. I th again, you know, it's one of those things where when we're talking to our guys, you know, we talk about making sure that um, we back our guys, our pitchers, that no matter what's going on offensively, that defensively, we, we still take care of business. Uh, I think he gave us a chance, obviously. Uh, in the first inning, you know, he had two outs, uh, ended up giving the – the homer up there in Carnacion, but overall, I mean, he came in to, to give us some innings, and, and he did. And, you know, obviously, I still think we had a chance. Uh, we get a four run, two and two. So we're still in the ball game for most of, the, for most of it. So, but we just couldn't get anything offensively going. Um, we have to work on that. And I think the guys understand that. And it's not about trying any harder. It's just about simplifying and, and staying focused on what they have to do and just trust the abilities that they have. Um, tomorrow's a new day.